Hi everyone and welcome back to the Happy Heart. I am so glad that you guys came over today to see another cleaning video. On this particular day, I was actually cleaning for the babysitter, believe it or not. Um, my friend had invited me to an event uh, this evening and it was out of town. So I was having a babysitter come over to my house, um, getting there around 3.30 and I knew I wasn't going to be back until very late in the evening so they were going to be there um, for the majority of the evening and I wanted to make sure that my house was somewhat put together and cleaned um, while you know they were there watching my son so that is kind of what inspired me to uh, start cleaning because as you can tell I had put it off for too many days I just felt like I had piles and piles of things like this file of mail just kind of hanging out everywhere. So um, as you can tell, I kind of um, end up just kind of prioritizing, going straight down the ladder, um, picking up everything, and then kind of cleaning, wiping things down. And I just kind of went in that priority and it worked out really well. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and those bell notifications so you don't miss any time that I upload. I upload usually on Wednesday and Sunday cleaning videos and I also upload during the week um, just a bunch of different fun videos. So don't miss anything, hit that bell notification and that subscribe button. I also uh, update you guys on Instagram daily. So the event I actually went to on this particular night, um, there's pictures of the event and all the fun stuff. So you get to see kind of what I do on a day-to-day -day basis. That is where I am updating mostly. So go over there, check me out, hit the follow, and then you'll always be up to date on what's going on. will see that there is a little plastic tub under my coffee table and that is all of my baby toys. It sounds really crazy but I had um, a little girl I was watching for a friend of mine. She was like two years old so that this actual tub is where I keep all of the baby toys so whenever a younger child comes over I can just take out this little tub and they can play with everything and it's all like my keepsake toys that I'm keeping for my own grandchildren. And it's stuff that my child played with when he was little and they were all my favorite stuff. And actually the doll in there is actually my doll from when I was a child as well. So I have this, you know, little tub. But it was so funny because I have these soft blocks 
and I was not prepared for the fact that like I lost about half of them and could not find them all over my living room and they were under and behind things and I had to have my son come help me and so just the things you forget about as your kids grow it was so funny. I would like to introduce myself and say my name is Lacey and I am a dustaholic. Yes, you heard that right, dustaholic. There is something in my brain where I feel like if I dust my house and there's not any dust and there's no uh, drink rings or anything on the wood, that it is clean and it just makes sense in my brain. So if I don't get anything else done, I usually pick up everything and I dust and that just makes me feel better and it makes me feel like the space is clean. So you guys will notice that I will show you clips of my phone and what I'm listening to at the moment. And on this particular day I had started with some random song and everything that I was listening to was just kind of touching my heart and it was just such good music and so that's why I showed you kind of the different songs so as different songs come on I've been showing them to the camera like this so you guys um, can see because I just felt like I wanted to share that with you I know there's so much good music on YouTube but I love it when you just kind of let it play through and all the songs are great
you guys so much for coming over and watching this cleaning video. I hope it motivated you to just kind of pick a room in your house and get started. I know oftentimes um, we just kind of procrastinate or we put off until the next day, which is exactly what I had done for days and days and days, as you could tell. But more importantly, um, it all got done and my house was clean for the babysitter. I took down some Halloween stuff and um, put back up some fall decorations and everything that needed to get done got done even though I had procrastinated a little bit longer than I should have. So we should definitely hold ourselves to a standard of grace instead of the standards of judgment that we normally hold ourselves to. Thank you all so much for coming over and hanging out with me. And I will see you all in my next brand new video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye for now.